Now, Thursday, 24th, just three days ago, I got a phone call. There's a guy that knows me. He knows me due, due to my books. He's been on my tours, he's been in a lecture. He likes what I do. He likes the history I unearth. And he said, I've got, a, I've got, a, I've got one for you, Lenny. Oh, okay. He says, I was fishing in Pit and Weem on the old harbour the other night there. Now, we've had remarkably low tides recently and uh, calm as you like, no wind, no rain, nothing. It's been gorgeous for fishing. Not gorgeous for midges, but gorgeous for fishing. And he was fishing just down here. He usually goes fishing with a friend, but this time uh, he was on his own, fishing away. It's nine o'clock at night, half nine, pitch dark, but he's got a head torch and he's quite happy to fish away. Well, all of a sudden, to his right, a screaming started. A woman screaming. It carried on for about 30 minutes. He was unnerved to the extreme. This is a, this is a big builder, this guy. But he was unnerved to the extreme that he was scared to walk back on himself down the harbour to face what was doing the screaming. The guy knew that I'd done lectures and wrote a story about a woman that was murdered here. He said to me, this was a woman screaming in absolute agony. He says, I'll put my hand on the Bible to what I heard. He says, I was so terrified, I fancied jumping in the water on the left hand side and swimming round rather than walk back up this way and confront whatever was doing the screaming. Peculiar days.